What's good, YouTube? That one ain't too here. Back again once again. And today, people, today we are here for another TCG opening. And today we are opening up the relatively new Zygarde collection. And I don't know about you guys, but Zygarde is definitely one of the most interesting newer mods in the game. And now they give him his own collection with a figurine too. And I cannot wait. You guys are hyped for some TCG openings. And of course, if you're a proud member of the Happy Nation, make sure you smash the like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. And we are praying we are hoping we are praying to the tcg gods today that we get some ex hype or some full art glory so this time around we have one two three four well oh wait 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 we have two packs of fates collide we have a breakthrough pack and a breakpoint pack as well in addition to the promo zygarde card that came with the pack rumble the defending pokemon can't retreat during your opponent's next turn geo strike this attack does 10 damage to each of your bench Pokemon. Now that is another move that should be in the game. Geo Strike sounds too powerful, too monstrous. Just Oko's just Geo Strike, nigga. Just nah. In addition to that, we also have the figurine here of Zygarde at 100%. We're gonna see if we can't put him together really quick. Like I'm gonna guess that you slide this in into ugh, like that, and you're gonna go ahead and just mount him. Uh, yes, go ahead, mount your Zygarde firmly on the back. <laughs> but we have our Zygarde figurine. Let's get the focus. There we go. Our Zygarde figurine all set up, ready to go. Look at that monster. I cannot wait to use Zygarde 100%. So, with that though, let's go ahead and dive into this uh, Mega Houndoom breakthrough pack uh, uh, and see what we have here. One, two, three. And we're going to start with a heavy ball. Then a fracture who's looking kind of upset. Why is why do it keep uh, it keeps going out of focus? It keeps trying to focus on the shit in the background. It's like no, you focus here, Mr. Camera. God damn it! But we have a fracture who is a dragon slayer apparently, and he's looking upset about something chilling in the back there. Then we have a float stone, a woobat, a rufflet, a chespin, another chespin. Ah damn, the chespin love is real. We have a Zorua. Oh, look how adorable. Then it has whiny voice. Fuck, how, I don't care how adorable you are. If you have a move called whiny voice, you can GTFO. I don't care. Then we have a reverse hollow swine up in the pack, and the rare is. Ooh, look at Raichu. That art is something serious. That art is something serious. Thunderclap shot. This attack does 50 damage to each of your opponent's Pokemon EX. Ooh. Ooh, is that is that included on the bench? I don't know. I don't know. Electro Smash. You flip a coin if heads attack does 20 more damage. My goodness. There's no there's no reason not to. Both those moves should be in the game. Thunderclap shot and electro smash. I say that so much. That should be in the game. That should be in the game. That should be in the game. But still, Thunderclap Shot, Electro Smash? Bruh. Bruh. Be real. Be real. It's not hollow. Oh, I'm so sad. He's not hollow. Oh. We have a breakpoint pack to dive into here next. Let's make sure we can get it as spoiler free as possible. Eh, oh, so sneaky. Oh my god. A one, a two, -hoo, a three. Up first, we have a Stantler, which who the hell remembers that Pokemon? Who the hell remembers Stantler to put him in a goddamn TCG set? We have a Stantler, then a Cricketune. Again, another Mon. Like, who the hell remembers Cricketune enough to put him in a goddamn set? Then we have Clister. We have a Ducklet. We have a Hone Edge. Ooh, looking mighty powerful. The Sword in the Stone. He's got one move just called Stab. Just Stab. Then we have a Glameow. He's got a move called Act Cute. He's got a move called Act Cute. Your opponent puts a card from his or her hand on the bottom of his or her deck. Damn. Then we have a Phantom. A Gibble. Never enough. Discard a card from your hand if you do draw two cards. <laughs> Look at Gibble's face! Look at Gibble's face! Oh my god. Then we have a reverse hollow shinx in the pack, and the rare is Woo! Yo boy! We are here! We have EX Hype! Oh come on, don't don't you dare get out of focus today. We got some Scizor EX hype in the pack. Steel Wing during your opponent's next turn. Any damage done to this Pokemon by attacks is reduced by 20. Gale Thrust. If this Pokemon was on the bench and became your active Pokemon this turn, this attack does 60 more damage. Isn't that like the uh uh the Bustin Dragonite they used to have? Is that is that what it did? 
it did more damage the turn it came out or some shit like that. I don't remember exactly. Or d was it like you could... I don't remember exactly how the Busting Dragonite worked. That was so long ago I saw that. But still, we have a Scizor EX. Hot damn. The EX hype. The Full Art Glory. Oh, we don't have Full Art Glory yet. We don't have Full Art Glory. But this time around, at least we have EX hype. Hot damn. You could chill in the back right there, Scizor. <gasps> Woo! Oh my god. I, I miss opening TCG for this reason alone. It is so hype. We just, just like, drum roll, please. <laughs> Enough making a fool out of myself. We have two packs of Fates Collide remaining here. So let's go ahead and bust this one open and see what we got. Bust it wide open. One, two, three. And we flip. We have a Servine. Ooh, I like this Servine. Serpentine Strangle. When you play this Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon, you may flip a coin. If heads, your opponent's active Pokemon is now paralyzed. Ooh. Energy reset. Put as many energy attached to your Pokemon as you'd like into your hand. Ooh. Then we have a Pupitar. We have a Coughing. We have a Spoink with Rocket Jump. <laughs> we have a Diglett. Look at this Diglett. This Diglett. Oh, someone at the Pokemon Company or Wizards or whoever makes TCG. I don't know. Does Wizards still make TCG? Do they? Is their logo still on here? Or have they not done that in years? Am I that far behind? Am I that far behind? Is it just the Pokemon Company International prints their own cards now? Whoever, whoever it is, you cannot tell me that you did not have devilish intentions when you made a Diglett card with the move Ram. I don't care what anyone has to say. You cannot tell me that you did not have dubious intentions when you made a Diglett card who looks like a dick and gave it the move Ram. I don't care. You can't tell me that. That's, that's, mm. Then we have a Larvitar. We have a Carbink as well. A Reverse Hollow Pokemon Fan Club. And the rare in the pack is... Oh, so much hype. Just for Mr. Mime. I'm sorry, Mr. Mime. You're great, but... Not EX hype or for our glory. He's got a move called Juggling. Flip four coins. Attack does 20 damage times the number of heads. Ooh, you juggle that damage, big boy. You juggle that damage. All right. We have one... One, count it, one! Fates Collide pack left. I'm gonna rub it. I'm gonna rub it. I'm gonna rub it and 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 rub it. And hopefully, have you guys ever seen like those those people that go to casinos and like the, the people that are playing the slot machines, they, they run up and they rub the machine before they play it because that's supposed to be good luck? We're gonna do that with our packs. We're gonna rub the packs. Not because Diglett has RAM, but just because we want, we're, it's for luck, okay? Trust me, it's for luck. So at first we have Random Receiver. Reveal cards from the top of your deck until you receive, reveal a supporter card. Put it into your hand, shuffle the other cards back into your deck. Ooh, this Kangaskhan. This Kangaskhan artwork. I thought that said Titty Punch. I want you to know, I thought it said Titty Punch. Tidy Punch and then Mega Punch. Ah, oh, damn, baby and mama. We have a Kabuto. We have a Coughing. We have a Spoink again, another Ram Diglett, oh my god. Then we have a Larvitter, we have a Carbink, we have a Reverse Hollow Jigglypuff, and the rare of the pack is Survey Says! Oh, it's an x -Cloud. I was so hyped, I was so excited! Woo! Cacophony, at the end of your opponent's next turn, discard the defending Pokemon and all cards attached to it. Ooh, Ambush, what point of heads this attack does 40 more damage. So it's a very strategic card, and you know what always bothered me about x -Cloud? Let me see how close I can get this. Look at how, look at that hole in his kneecap. Tell me that doesn't make you uncomfortable. Tell me that does not make you uncomfortable. Just the, just the fact that he has a orifice on his kneecap. That, does, that doesn't make you uncomfortable? Okay, now imagine, imagine, imagine this Ram Diglett popping out of that orifice. Just, just out of that orifice, that Ram Diglett. You uncomfortable yet? Let's stop being creepy and do our recap. Of course, we got the Zygarde. You better focus. We got the Zygarde. You better focus. There we go. We got the Zygarde figurine in the pack. We have the promo Zygarde card as well. And then we have the Scizor EX to go ahead and cap things off. So we got a little bit of EX hype in this collection box opening. So I definitely enjoyed popping this one open, especially because that promo card is just bad ass. 
and that EX hype. Ugh, we were so close to some full art glory. But if you guys enjoyed as well, and of course we are proud of that happy nation, make sure you smash the like button down below for us because you already know your support is really appreciated. And I will catch you guys in our next TCG opening. With that though, I'm gonna get about. Thank y'all once again for your support and thank you for sharing the video. We out this bitch. Bye!